What's up, FE Clan? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be reviewing this Yagi Gel Blaster. We're going to be testing the FPS and the accuracy with some of my new technologically advanced gadgets here. Also, at the same time, I'm going to be giving away a Gel Blaster today, so make sure to stay tuned all the way through the video to find out which Gel Blaster you could possibly win and what you have to do to win it. Let's get into the video right away. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna unbox this Yagi Gel Blaster right now. It's the AK-47 electric water bullet gun. And this uses a battery to fire gel beads out of it, guys. Let's take this thing out of the box. Let's check out what it comes with. And then let's test out all of its features. It comes with the blaster. It also comes with the rear end here, which kind of just slides on the back end right there. Bada bing, bada boom, you got yourself a fully assembled mini AK-47. And then it comes with this hopper uh, funnel. So basically you're just gonna kinda snap this right on there and you're gonna wanna line it up with the hole that's on the top. And let's see what else it comes with. Got a couple more things in here. So you've got instructions, which uh, I just ripped mine in half. And then we've got a the other half of the instructions. We've got a box here. I'm gonna assume this box has uh, Orbeez goggles. So there's the Orbeez. You get 15,000 Orbeez with this uh, gel blaster. We've got a free gel blaster event, A or B. Order a refund, one gel blaster limit, or you can get another gel blaster for free. So if you guys order one of these, you get a chance to uh, get another gel blaster for free, which is pretty cool. I will have the link in the description down below for this specific gel blaster. Uh, like I said, it comes with goggles. It comes with the charger. Oh, hey there. You want to hear a joke about a funny joke telling a joke? Uh, my dog told me to say that. That's supposed to be the joke, the whole thing. Anyways, I interrupt my regularly scheduled boring program telling you about boring stuff to show you guys this amazing gel blaster I'm going to be giving away to you. You may notice the shape. It's the Yagi gel blaster that I'm doing the review on right now inside that Connex. So we're custom painting this for you and it's going to be awesome. Here's a short montage for you to watch. have to do to win this Yagi Gel Blaster is subscribe to the channel. Use the code word code down below in the comment section and follow me on Instagram Mr. Fe. Let's get back to the regularly scheduled program. You could take the orange cap off the front just like that and drop it on the ground and you can replace it with this cool little uh, purple tip like that. It comes with the funnel or the hopper. So this hopper can hold Orbeez inside of it. You can carry it around on your belt or in your pocket um, with you while you're playing the gel blaster game. If you have several of these, you put the lid on it, you carry it around with you, you take the lid off, you turn the blaster upside down and you screw the hopper on. So now you're fully locked and loaded and ready to go. Let's go. All right, here's our target, about 15 feet away. Let's see how accurate this thing is. So I'm gonna get the one down. All right, but it does get it. Number two, number three, and number four. It got two, three, and four very quickly. And as you can see, all the targets popped right back up for me to shoot again. This is one of the coolest accessories I've seen for gel blasters so far. Okay, so it is pouring rain out here right now. We've got the FPS reader right here in front of the camera. I'm gonna go ahead and fire a couple of shots through. We're gonna see how powerful this thing is. All right, we got 124, 122, 123, 122, 127. 127, 125, 127, 123. We've got 137, 116, 113, 125, 26, 134, 132, 
I want to fire a couple through it. I saw a 140 in there. So when you're held, when you're holding it down, it looks like it's firing 8.5 rounds per second, and uh, the average is probably about 130. And last but not least, the pain test. I'm about to get shot from about 15 feet away, the same distance we were shooting the target, to see how painful 120, 130 FPS actually feels. And that way I can let you guys know whether it's a good buy or a bad buy or, you know, just a buy, you know? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut that out. Get this done, let's go. Okay, okay. All right, all right. So, you definitely know that you're getting hit, that's for sure. It's a slight sting every time a bullet hits you, but then it goes away within seconds. So I'd say this is a safe toy blaster for, I'd say, maybe 10 and up. The box says 14 and up, but I think that's just for safety protocol or whatever you want to call it. Three videos coming out every single week. Make sure to subscribe, watch this video and this video. We'll see you next time.